Well, good morning. <clears throat> Sunday morning. I've been at it for a couple hours. Um, I guess I got to make sure I talk loud. Uh, all the walls are done. We're working on, uh, right now, we're working on the joists. I've got uh, the living room done. The living room is metal, it's going to be a metal roof. We've already got all the metal. An old barn that got tore down, we're going to use that. That's a heavy duty steel. It'll look kind of cool, got a little rust patina to it and different spots. Um, bedrooms, uh, laundry, all that's going to be drywall. So it gets a different setup for the joists. This is just set up strictly for steel roof. So I'm only going about 30 inches on center. Uh, two by six construction, of course. I have one section over here where we're, we've had to lag two together, sister them basically, uh, because they're, it's further than 16. These are 16 foot two to sixes. And uh, I'm doing this by myself, so it's a little tough getting up there and anchoring it. Uh, I haven't put the top plates on any of the walls yet because I want to get all this done, then I'm going to put the top plate on and basically frame around these ceiling joists so that I know they're, they're captured. Um, well, I've got some more to do. I'll show you this, this one that I just did and then uh, I'll be back later. As you can see, if I can hold this thing, <laughs> sorry about that. All right, so as you see, I basically got two 16 foot two by sixes screwed together. I've got uh, two, four, six, eight screws in there. And then uh, come down here and we have one of these runners that goes the full length of the building that is screwed down to it as well. So it's pretty much not going to go anywhere. And I'm just messing up the picture. <laughs> uh, but like I said, this area here is different because this is where the steel roofing will all be in the living room, family room, whatever the heck you want to call this room. The great room. There you go. Great room. I like great room. Anyway, I got to go in now and start crossing over on the other one. This is the worst one. This is going to take some thinking because I've got a clear span from there all the way to there and I have to get one across there. That's just too wide, even for steel. So I'm going to be working on that next. We'll be back. Okay. Let's see. I doubt that got them up here. I went ahead and used old garage door man technology. Here where I have this open deal all the way back there. And then all the way over to here, that's 30 feet. So what I did, I've got, I've got them attached to that cross two by four there and to that one there. And then what I did up here, actually, you know what? Hang on a minute. I used the uh, back hang from the garage door. And uh, that thing's lagged in with some massive lags. So it isn't going anywhere, it's solid as a rock. And then that one there, as you can see, I got all those screws as I showed you before. So pretty good, pretty good. Then I came in here and, oh, we're still too close, aren't we? <laughs> uh, sorry about that. So this thing, I know it looks funky. It's set up for drywall. Just the uh, original beams that were in there just weren't any good. Like, I mean, not, not that they weren't any good. They just, they didn't line up right. They're at the wrong spots, so. 
I'm not gonna ruin and waste good drywall. I did the, this section too, so the master bathroom is done. The living room's done. I gotta do this closet I just came out of. And then uh, I started over here. I was about to go for that one there and start. This is the guest room, but uh, to be honest, I haven't worked on a ladder in so long that my legs are killing me. So, time to take a break, you know. So, instead, I just came in here to start working on the, on the shower stall again. Oh, now this here, this here's the assembly that we're going to be using. Um, it basically glues down onto that pipe, boom, like that. But, but you know, it can't be up high, and I have to sink it in. So, hence the old air hammer. I checked it out, see if it works, and by golly it does. So, I'm going to be chiseling out concrete. Would have been nice if I had a sand bed, but I forgot it. And then the concrete guy who said, don't worry about it, I'll take care of it, he forgot it. So, oh well, we all tried, but we all forgot. That shit happens. <laughs> so, we'll fix it. Oh, add that one and that one. And then the flange, I gotta cut that, put that in. So, Moving along, moving along. Um, got to get some more two by fours. I got this. This is the only actual work with wood I still have to do is this door. Um, I started working on it. This door and then the door into the toilet in the master bedroom, master, master suite, whatever you call that thing. The ensuite. Uh, I got this done. This here is uh, kind of, as you see, it's a, it's interesting. <clears throat> I still have to figure out something on how to to to. I got to get a couple more two by fours in there for nailing the drywall too. The same as over here. Over here I got a little more creative and had to actually make some cuts to create this funky looking wood. I don't know if you can even tell what that did. There's a two by four there. That's the, the short side, the one and, and a half side. And a two by four there, that's the one and a half side. And then I have this one here as you see, I made that corner down there, and it goes all the way up to there. This side over here, not so much easily. I couldn't get the cut on it, and this table saw just wouldn't do it. So I ended up doing a spacer. So I've got a spacer in on this side, because again, this wall kicks left. This wall actually isn't straight either. This kicks out. See a straight line back there in the, I don't know if you can see that line right there. So you see it, that wall isn't straight either. All intentional, mind you, all intentional. Um, so I've got to work on that. But that's little custom stuff and that's, that's fine. All the main framing is done. This whole wall going in. Hello there, that's Abby. Hello Abby. Yes? Speak to the camera, Abby. No? Okay. Never mind. So this wall's all ready. I got all that done. Everything is done. Main framing is done. So, electrical's next. Pulling wires. Oh boy. All right, man. Well, y'all take care now. See you later.